So I've just returned from a week-long photo workshop in Iceland, and while our primary goal for the workshop was aurora photography, we of course took advantage of the many picturesque landscapes all along the south coast and did some uh, landscape and waterfall photography along the way. Now, Case Filters did send me their uh, Case Revolution Magnetic Filter Kit. This is the Pro ND kit to test out along the way, and that's what this video is going to be about, is a quick review of that kit. Now the first thing I want to highlight is like the case itself, the materials that it's made of. Um, everything seems to be quite durable, it's well padded, seems protected for the filters, they fan out nicely, easily accessed. There's little tabs along the top that you can insert labels into to make it easy to identify. Um, but in one of the first few days I had this out, we were at the Black Beach and I had it sitting down well away from the water and the waves, but of course the one creeper wave snuck up on me, completely covered the case full of water, full of black sand, and while the sand itself was a little bit difficult to get out of there and took some cleaning, rinsing, um, everything seems to have held up just fine. No issues with that whatsoever. So all in, this seems pretty well made. I also particularly enjoy the magnetic closure that's on here. You just line up the little button on there, snaps in place, easy to pop open when you need it. The next thing about these is I really enjoy the color-coded sides that they have on the filters. You can see the colored ring on the edge of it and know exactly what you're pulling out. Uh, the kit itself comes with a CPL circular polarizer, a ND8, an ND64, and an ND1000, as well as the front-end lens cap, uh, the magnetic adapter ring to thread onto the front elements of your lens, and what might be my favorite part is the magnetic inlaid ring, as they call it. Now this is just a tiny little ring, super thin, that gets threaded directly into the, the front threads of your lens or onto the front of an existing filter that you may have. Uh, it does come with a little tool to make this happen. You can just line up the little notches on this tool with the notches in the ring and use that as sort of your wrench to thread this on. But what I found is it seems to be a lot easier to just adhere it magnetically to one of your filters, or in this case, the step up ring, and then just thread that on as you would any other filter. And when it's in place, now you've got a magnetic ring directly inside of the manufacturer's threads of your lens to which you can attach the filters, the step up rings, whatever it is. So in my case, I've got the 95 millimeter set. This is a 77 millimeter thread lens. So I'll throw on the 77 magnetic adapter and I'm ready to go, just like that. And of course, they're magnetic and stackable. So in this case, I almost always will you be using a CPL, circular polarizer, for landscape photography. And it's that simple. Just slap it on, take it off. And then like I said, they're stackable. So if I want the circular polarizer and slow down the motion, I can take my ND, stack it on top, and being that they're magnetic, I can rotate to use the polarizer, I can take both off, one off, whatever I need. It's super slick, super fast to use. Beats the heck out of trying to thread and unthread things when you're out in the field. Now, as far as the optical quality of these filters, I have noticed very, very little, if any, color cast, color shift when using the NDs. Uh, you can see that in some of these comparison images here, where the, the first image taken at this waterfall without any sort of filter whatsoever, obviously we can stop the motion of the water, we throw on the ND, take the same frame with a longer exposure, of course, let that water smooth out a little bit, but you really can't tell a difference in terms of the color quality of this. So I'm very pleased overall with, with the optical quality of the glass used in these filters. The other part I really like about these is while they do feel very, very well made, good construction on these, they're extremely lightweight. Uh, obviously I can't demonstrate that in a video here, but having this whole kit pulled together is hardly any additional weight on in my pack or on my in my pack or on my tripod my body wherever I have these things carried and at the end of the day this is my full filter kit now granted these are stacked together and not in their protective case 
but it's super small, super compact, super light, um, and very thin too, which is nice, especially when you're using the inlaid ring. I can just throw these directly in front of the lens and there's almost no vignetting, even on wide angle lenses. The other thing I really love about these filters is it's probably one of the more overlooked features, but it's it's the lens cap that they with this. It just makes it so simple for me, especially when I've got a step up ring involved in a smaller lens, to just be able to throw that right back on, go about my day, throw this back in my bag, whatever it is, and I'm, I'm ready to go, it's well protected. I don't have to worry about trying to snap the original manufacturer's lens cap onto there, which does work. It's just, I don't feel it's quite as tight as the original. So I do like that they included the additional lens cap, super slick. So all in all, I'm really quite pleased with this, this filter set. Um, I think the, like I said, my favorite thing was the inlaid magnetic adapter ring that it comes with. I found that to be one of the most useful features of this. It's really slick, really easy to use. And the other part of it is uh, the lens that I'm filming this on. It's a 95 millimeter thread and it has a coarse thread, uh, which means I needed to throw a, an adapter ring on it already to be able to get some of my other filters onto it, so on and so forth. So. I had a step up ring that I was using already that I could very easily just put the magnetic inlaid ring into and now that existing step up ring that I had becomes a magnetic filter holder that I can use with the rest of this kit. So it really extends the functionality of the gear that you, that you already own. So yeah, I really would recommend this kit for anyone looking for a new set, um, something easy to use out in the field. The full disclosure case did provide me with this filter set, but they are not sponsoring this video. They're not seeing the review prior to posting. So this is my honest reaction to it. Um, if you got any questions, hit me up in the DMs. If you like this video, if you found it helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.